You've played like one of the last 14 or 15 games. You have a tear in your meniscus. Why are you jumping around on stage like this? Because you got to understand, all that shows you're fragile, but also the way you just re-injured yourself. You were on a dunk. Wasn't quite a breakaway, but you were alone for the most part, mm -hmm. dunking, and you just landed, and now you got a bone bruise and a slight tear in your meniscus. You're fragile. So it's not, I'm not a doctor and I'm not claiming to be, but it's not beyond the realm of possibility that while you jumping around on stage like that. I don't see a lot of jumping. I, really? Dancing. He wasn't doing this. Yeah. Oh. No, no. You he can get up down. there, you can get up there and just move exactly. the old school. He, he went, running no. around jumping like he rapping. Like, like that's too much. And again, I, I, I'm for freedom and, and fun, but in your situation, you have to be smart. His judgment is off because a few weeks recently he said he thinks he can play 40 minutes a night. So your judgment is not correct. Oh, 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 wait. You can't play 40 minutes a night. The so then don't tell him. me you... Really? I wonder why. You <laughs> dunked and you landed and you tore your meniscus. Right, okay. So I wouldn't let him either. Okay, so that's fine. But he, it's not like he's the one asking out of games, right? He's, he's hurt right now. I understand that. But and he was only playing 25 minutes a game? Right, because they are being extra cautious with him on the court, No, right? be, but because he's hurt. No, but going into the year, Chris, they said he's not going to play back-to-backs. We're going to take it slow, correct? Right. There's, but... There's reason yes, for it. I know there's reason that, for it. It's because he's... And, and this all proves they were right. right. And if he was doing great... Because he's hurt. ...in the 20 minutes, they would have increased him. Just right. like any other... Yeah, it was going to be a gradual... In and it was a gradual increase. Agreed. He went up to 28 a little bit. Agreed. Okay. I'm not... No, no one's disputing that the Sixers need... Listen, he is an enormous asset. If he is healthy, if you can guarantee me a healthy decade from Joel Embiid, I might take that over whatever we're going to get from Carl Anthony Towns. Like, yes, he is, I hear you. He's a great player that has had an injury history. And the team, because of that, is being very cautious with him. I get all of that. But that ain't got nothing to do with dance on stage at Meek Mill concert. He, he's running. Do you dance like that? What? I don't really. He's running around, dancer. jumping right. all over. Them. And I, I get it. Like, I guess the doctors, even the Sixers, have said it wasn't a big deal. But you know what? <laughs> Andrew Bynum went bowling a couple years ago mm -hmm. and re-injured his knee. Bowling is not in the contract of things NBA players can't do. Mm -hmm. We didn't think it was a big deal when he went bowling, but he played 52 games the rest of his career. He was 25 years old, mm -hmm. okay? J Jalil Okafor, last year, yes. had a slight tear. They called it minor in the meniscus. Said he'll be out six weeks. He was back in seven months. Mm -hmm. This dude has to recognize you are a basketball player who's got injury problems who's fragile. You don't, again, go up on stage, suck it, soak up all the love. Yo, what's up? Yeah. Even grab the mic if you want. Spit a few That's, bars. Ain't nothing, ain't nothing Bob a little that. bit. But you running around like that? When you just yeah, dunked playing. it and got hurt and not play? Nah, I'm sorry. You well, gotta for chill. One, for one, yeah. you, you've been out 10 games, mm -hmm. okay? There's one reason why Joel will be, can, can we agree to this first of all, just some principles. There's one reason why he's in Philadelphia. Right? That's to play basketball. Yes. Yeah. Right? Meek Mill is in Philadelphia. For one thing, right? Correct. The promoters, yeah. right? To promote his music and to perform on stage, Correct. right? Yep. That, that's, mm -hmm. that's the thing, right? He's paid to play basketball. This guy is paid to rap, sing music, dance, and do all that. Now, Meek Mill ain't going to help me do my job. <laughs> This is one thing with Odell Beckham them that, that I got upset. They wasn't talking about Trey Strong and them. They talking about the athlete. Right. Because the athlete is bigger in certain perspective than the entertainer. And I'm paid to do something. It's very immature. It's very unprofessional. It's also very unreliable. All right? You're paying me to do something. All right? And when I can't do that, I'm not out doing anything else. Hold on a second. Okay. He's not wow. asking Philly to pay him to be at the Meek Mill concert. He's in his own damn time. The doctors said we're not worried about it. Colangelo the doctors have been wrong okay. plenty of times Hold in Philadelphia. Wait a moment. And it'd be one thing if he was healthy. Yeah. He's not yeah. healthy. We own your body. Okay. Hold now, you can say whatever you want about your free time and all that. Mm -hmm. Exactly. But that team that you signed that contract with, when that check comes with the Philadelphia 76ers on it, like, you are obligated. That All that money is guaranteed. 
Here's, I understand that, but here's what we know, and this is what is so maddening about this to me. If Joel Embiid were doing this in the locker room, nobody cares. It's no, no, we would care. No, 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 I would care. If, if, I bet you they might no. walk in and be like, T take it easy a little bit. Take it easy. Okay. Yeah, you're not playing. I'm, I'm from the Pat Riley school. Pat Riley walks into the locker room and says, hey, buddy. How you feeling today? I'm, I'm feeling pretty good. Now, if we were in the playoffs, could you play 10 minutes? And, and it'd be like, yeah, coach, I think I could do it. Pat Riley would be like, hey, MF, get your uniform on. Right, and <laughs> okay? so, hold on, but that's why I was saying in the beginning, and let me, let me try to lay this out real quick. He's not the one holding himself out of games. If Embiid were the one, Chris, wait. If Embiid were the one saying, I'm not healthy enough to play, and then he's on stage at a concert, I got a beef with it. But like you said, the team's holding him out because he tore his meniscus, or partially tore his meniscus, dunking the basketball. He's not dunking a basketball on stage. He didn't hurt himself on stage. It's his own damn time. He's 22 years old. There ain't no, man, when you it, is, it is his own time. No, there ain't, there ain't no own time when you're under contract. What, so all day, every day, you got to check him with the coach? It ain't his damn parole officer. He's, he, listen, this is a man, hold up. He, go ahead. No, a little, a little more context. Guy came from Cameroon, got to the state six years ago. He, his, uh, two years ago, his younger brother randomly died in a car crash. If you don't think this is a guy who might say, you know what, life is fleeting, fame is fleeting. You know what I'm else gonna... could be fleeting? Your NBA career. Yeah. All right? <laughs> and then who going to care about it? Hold up. Is Meek Mill going to want him on right. stage there's one when your career why... is over? Hey, there's one reason why they got him from Cameroon, right? Yeah, there's exactly. One for him to play exactly. basketball. And there are other ways to unwind <laughs> yeah. and let it, let it hang yeah. out. Let it all hang out. Again, I'm fine with you going up on stage and, and dapping up Meek Mill. Yeah. Just don't run around like, like that when yeah, you, you're injured. You, you do something and like you, that and not show up to work. You're going to see a side of Chris Carter you don't like. But, he, but he's not not showing up to work. He, he, he can't play. He, he, he can't play. They were clearly right. Maybe 25 <laughs> minutes was too much, Nick. Yeah. He's being, Maybe we should have had it be 15 minutes. Maybe you wouldn't be He's injured. brittle, man. That's he's the thing, told. Nick. He's brittle. He's no, being told. He was being Stop told. He was being he's told. Being he's being told wrong. by his bosses he can't play. In his own Can day, he play? Chris, let me finish. He's being told by his bosses he can't play. In his own time, he's going to a concert. Those The, the team doctor's saying, we ain't got no problem with it. Brian Colangelo's saying, I just wish he wasn't jumping around. I just watched I that I bet you they're saying something different behind closed doors. Okay, well, that's an interesting, like, argument method, which is if they say something I agree with, they're right. If they say something I disagree with, they must be lying. But what we know is What's this. an interesting argument is you saying the team's not letting him play. He's injured. Yeah. He, can't <laughs> he can't play. play. I understand. It ain't about... You want to go back two months? Yeah, they holding him back. Now, you can't play. Right. Did he injure himself at the concert? No. Okay. Did he but get he's is injured he gonna, before the concert. Is he going to suit up in the next game? No. Okay. He might not he play. Like we time. might but not next see week, him is he for two get more paid? months. Is he going to get paid, though? Any... How you like that? That's fine. But that's got nothing to do with the damn concert. It does. How? You shouldn't be running around in any way, shape, or form. You think, you think that's part of his rehab? What? You think that's part of his rehab? I do not think no matter what your damn job is, you have an obligation to do to your employer 24-7, 365. If you show up for work when you're asked to show up for work, and that's all you got to do. He's not doing that. Yeah, because work is playing in the exactly. game. Exactly. <laughs> that's work. Part, wait, he's look, incapable look, look, of doing his part job. Part of the rehab. Wait a second. Just slow down yeah. for a second. When you're a professional athlete mm -hmm. and you're not playing, mm -hmm. okay, your day consists of still going to meetings mm -hmm. and still going to rehab. And also going to see the doctors and also getting all the checkups. Because he missed any that, of those. That is all part of your rehab. Correct. Now, I'm sure whatever exercises the exercise therapist had him doing that day, I'm sure they did not tell him, you know something tonight? You know what I need you to do? I need you to go do 30 jumping jacks with Meek Mill up on the stage. Exactly. Can we okay? play that Basically what he was doing. Do you know what the, the function of the meniscus is? Well, yeah, side okay. to side d movement. Okay, yeah. yeah. Look there at him. Go. Yeah. There you go. Look at him. Yeah, let's Look at, see it. Come let's, on. Chris, Chris, I'll give you all the money in my pocket. You show me him jumping. He don't jump. He might as well he, be jumping. Okay, but he's not jumping. He ain't doing no jumping jacks. He ain't doing no jumps. Guess Lifting what he's doing? up your leg and Lifting all that stuff. Your leg. Look at that. God. And again, I just look, love, I just love how many people know more Nick, about Embiid's body than Embiid and the team. Well, this, Embiid, this, this, no, Embiid no, no. just said he can play 40 minutes a night. Wait a second, wait a second. Who knows more? Does no, he no, know no. about his body? Chris, he thinks he can play Chris, 40 minutes a this night. This is what I do know. I had a guaranteed contract. I was 16 years under contract. And also, I know the fine print as far as what I couldn't do. I 
when because I was such a good basketball player and so consumed with playing basketball. You know what the Vikings when they gave me the big contract? No basketball playing. Okay. No snowboarding, no jet skis, a whole bunch of no, 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 no. And you know why you know why I signed that contract? Because I was there for the Minnesota Vikings football club and that guaranteed so money. That's that's great. And if they put in his contract. Don't dance on stage at concerts, then I'll be right You here. would think he got enough common sense. Exactly. And let me ask you this. When in, you've been in, injured Andrew, for two years, go ahead. Andrew Bynum's contract. They didn't have you can't go bowling. Yeah. But he injured himself bowling. Man, like this, uh, this idea, this is where, and this is me. Nobody's like, saying they got to run your whole life. That is exactly what No, it's what not saying. what we're saying. I ain't say you couldn't go to the concert. No, I said don't get up and setting, run around like a maniac. That's up, it. You're setting up these false premises. You're saying, no, no, no. If he if he would have gotten on stage and just dapped him up and sung a few bars, you'd be yes. with it. I would have been cool with that. Out. That's fine. You would have been fine with it. But you and I both know, Chris, that other people would have been. The, the, you're drawing a line at dancing. Who would have been? I, yeah, yeah, that's a physical activity. Okay, you're drawing a line at dancing. Other people would have drawn the line at going there. Here's hold my, on. Who's drawing the line there? Honestly. But, Who's drawn the line and said, you're injured, you can't go man, to a concert? I don't think there's talk shows in Philly that are going to be saying you should be in the gym, you should be in the no, gym. No, 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 I'm yeah, sorry. I'm, are, not guys, I'm not giving you that. Those are guys I'm not giving you that. Hold up, wait. Is it, I'm just going to make this very clear. The, here's the line I draw. Are you abiding by your contract? Are you, are, are you abiding by your contract? He's in violation is, is, of his contract. Uh, exactly. He's in violation of his contract. Uh, is the contract going to go to rehab? When we go to break, I'm going to get you a couple agents to talk to you.